guys, it's... <clears throat> so, as you can probably tell, the logo is pink, and so I decided to wear a little bit of pink, okay? Just trying to help them out. Hi guys, it's Keisha, and for this video, it's very exciting. The weather outside is beautiful, so my lighting is beautiful. But over here, you can see all of these products right here. I am going to be reviewing all of these products, and as you can tell, there is a lot, so there may or may not be a giveaway coming up extremely soon, and when I say may or may not be, I think you know what I may be saying, right? Yeah? There's going to be multiple giveaways in these next few months, so please stay excited and stay tuned, because there's going to be tons of stuff that I'm pretty sure you guys will want. You know, I just, I'm ready to have a community now, you know? I've had the fun with being like an independent YouTuber and, you know, not having a to worry about requests as much. I get to just do whatever I want. And now I am ready to have a community and I want you guys to tell me what you guys want to see. In case you're wondering about my hair, I will leave down below. I have like recommended that video like in almost every video. I just love it and I want you guys to love it. It is my Egyptian curl um, video and I will leave it down below. I love it. I is my go-to style. I use it like all the time. I get so many compliments on how pretty my hair looks and healthy and it just does all the right things for my hair. So I hope it does the same for you. I will actually insert a picture now. So I showed you this picture because you could sort of see the length. Like it doesn't really quite touch my shoulders. That's how like curly in definition it was. And then in this picture you can see more of the pattern and it's sort of like a tight loose curl and then I wore that for two days and then I wore this type of style for about three days and it was a little bit more fuller and I really liked it. So that is what my hair looks like and this is the fourth or fifth day and I love how much volume it has, um, how shiny it is. I don't know if I'll do another tutorial on what I used for this one. If you guys want to see that, please like this video that way I know or comment down below too because that would be great. I already have a tutorial on how to do the hairstyle. But I could definitely show you what I do up to the hairstyle point if you guys want to see that. If you do, then I'm excited. And if not, then there's tons of other things that I have planned. I am going to do a wonderful week. I don't know what it's going to be called yet. Maybe it will be called Wonderful Week. Let's do this for you guys. The week is going to be so amazing. So just hold on. I'm not sure if I'm going to upload every day of the week. But I definitely know I'm uploading more than once a week. Um, this week, that, like this one, this one that we're in. Um, so I know that I'm going to be uploading like three times. I'm trying to upload every single day though. So be excited for that. I mean, I'm excited. Okay, you guys excited? I'm excited. Anyway, this video is for the first video of the week. And I am by myself for this video. Um, but don't worry, there are going to be tons of people this week. So Anyway, this tutorial is for Eva Butter. Eva Butter, baby. So I've already used Eva Butter. And I used it... Like, if you guys can see my hair, I don't know if it's focused or not. Okay. Enough with the intro, now on to the video. <laughs> so I am just going to hop inside of the shower and get my hair wet. I'm going to part it in about four to six sections. So here I'm like spraying this like leave-in conditioner and water mixture. But I don't recommend doing this anymore like recently like a day ago I'm going to start dry detangling so like adding an oil and detangling because that's the safer way to go um so yeah just don't do that it, it, it's like yeah no the way that I'm like raking my hands through my fingers or through my hair is nice though so this is why I recommend dry detangling because that's way too much product buildup in my hair. But if you were doing dry detangling, then I would just put the pre-treatment on top of the oil detangled mask. Green one because this is a pre-treatment. Sections. Part hair into four to six sections. I have four sections here. One, two, three, four. Um, and then I ha it says lightly. Spray hair lightly with water. Uh, it says spray hair lightly with water, and I didn't do that. My hair is drenched, um, and that's because I had to rinse out the uh, detangler, so which is another reason why dry detangling is a good idea. So it's a nice creamy consistency. It's very thick. I'm liking that. Uh, so I'm just going to unravel my hair and just apply it on each side down each section. Oh, that's really nice, guys. Usually when I apply product in my hair, when my hair is dripping wet, it takes away all of the nice shine that the water has. 
so this is really nice. It smells really good, by the way. From scalp to ends is what it said, so I'm going to get some more. Uh, wrong. That was plenty. I made my heart crusty when I put in too much, like that little glob right there. Yeah, no. Anyway, let's fast forward and get to the part of the leave-in conditioner. The mask that I used with the green heart instead of the pink heart. The conditioner that I absolutely freaking love. And this is the leave-in conditioner. Now we're at the leave-in conditioner part. I know it looks extremely similar to the mask or pre-treatment part. Trust me, I was editing and I got the clips mixed up, but now they are in the rightful order. So I had rinsed out the mask and it sat for like 30 minutes. It said up to 15, but I did 30 minutes without heat and now I'm on to the leave-in conditioner. I added the buttermint smoothie and it didn't work for my hair, but in a few weeks I will be doing another review um, for an alternative of, to the buttermint smoothie. Um, yeah, because I don't know, it did something really weird to my ends, uh, but the leave-in conditioner I love and the conditioner I love. So, yeah. Hey guys, it's finally back inside of the morning. It's morning time. Woohoo! So excited. Um, last night I just stopped filming because it got really late and I kept the mask on for too long and kept it on for like 40 minutes instead of like 15. Um, so, you know, it sort of cut into the rest of the time and the quality was just so hideous. I couldn't bring myself film so so my thoughts are I love it and I love the conditioner and the leave-in everything would have been great as you can see here my hair was just twisted up everything would have been great if I just didn't add the buttermint smoothie uh, but next time I know better you know and I'm not gonna lie the buttermint smoothie really jacked up my ends it was so sad so I did use the honey I'm strong by herbal essences and the IU Natural uh, Oil to repair my hair and it did a great job at repairing it. Um, but I did love all the other products. They're all very moisturizing. Even though the Buttermint did something weird, it still made my hair moisturize. So we're all good. Oh, I forgot to say, I am going to be doing a video featuring the Lovely Curl. I'm probably going to do the pre-treatment mask again. Um, just because I feel like I messed it up. I didn't give it a full chance. So I am going to redo it uh, very soon. But, you know, you heard my little abbreviations. And I love you guys so much. Thank you for tuning in for this video. I love you. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Thank you so much, Everbutter, for your wonderful support and all of your just gifts. They were beautiful, and I had a wonderful time working with you. Even though I did work with Everbutter, my opinions have not been changed or altered in any way. These are how I feel about it, and yeah, I love you guys. Bye. I am in the 80s style right now. I got my hot pink knit shirt, my one shoulder. I need a refresher, like the curls are looking a little scraggly or looking a little dry, um, or they're starting to frizz up. I use some of this, and I use um, some other stuff that I will also have during this week, so make sure to stay tuned. I'm good to go.